Okay, we're here at 2266 El Contento Drive in Los Angeles, 9006A. Now, we're here to check the main sewer line. We obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. We're here to check the main line. And um, you'll have your general inspector crawl underneath the house and stuff. But just to let you know, we had a quick little look underneath the house and we did notice that everything was ABS plastic. So we have a four inch two way clean out located here in the front of the house where it exits on the right hand side. And running the camera downstream, we're all the way out to the city connection in the street. You can see the city sewer flowing by there. So we're going to bring the camera back. Now you can see what's going to happen over here. It goes into a little bit of water over here as we bring the camera back. You know, so bring it back out so we'll see how much water is standing in the line here. You know, so let me just explain something to you. Whoa! Yeah. Um, go back in a little bit. Okay. Um, so what I can tell you, there's a little bit of a belly in the line. However, I located this underneath the street and it shows like about four and a half feet deep. Now, the thing is, um, I looked into the street and I see a lot of these utilities running through here. There's a lot of water valves and electrical and gas. And I have a strange suspicion that the reason why there's a little bit of water standing in the line is because of these utilities running over here. And there's really not much you're going to really be able to do about this little belly in the line. Now, this is my opinion. This is strictly on my opinion. I, uh, now, also, what I want to say is that there's a very good grade going downhill over here. The house is way up and the street is way below. Personally, I don't think this is going to be a problem over here. And I'm not going to give an estimate to repair it because I believe that it's very possible that the utilities are in the way and that's why you don't have what you have. It's only four and a half feet deep at the city connection, so it's not very deep. The line is very clean though and there's no problems in it. Now we're going to bring the camera back. It's But if you go to the end, Alex, go to the end and let's have a look. Let's have a look to see the connect right at the end. Well, there's ABS, but there's the clay. It's the same size. I don't believe so. It's the same size. It's not like they pushed anything in. So, in my opinion, and there's a four inch, I, I, I just don't think that's a problem over there. And that's my opinion. And I don't think you most likely will be able to fix it anyway. Coming up onto the property, it's all ABS plastic main line. It's all in good condition. Whatever you do, don't flush tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. We're going to pause the recording and run our camera upstream. Okay, so what we're doing is we're running our camera upstream. Uh, we had a look underneath the house. You can see pretty much all ABS plastic. However, what it does is it ties into a very old cast iron pipe where it starts to go under the step. I'm going to show you that. So this is all ABS. Uh, the main line, all in good condition. And you can see the connections as we come along the way. This is all in very good condition. Like I mentioned, you have a very good grade going downhill, which is definitely a plus. Now, right over here, it's going to go through the foundation of the house with a very old cast iron pipe. And they left this alone because what it does, it goes underneath the steps. And you can see over here, the pipe is pretty much very old. And if we come back a little bit, I even think I saw some roots coming into the line. It's a very old cast iron pipe.
right right over here you have pretty much some roots getting in so the pipe is pretty much coming to the end of its life looks like okay <laughs> so here we come you want to just push it back in again now let's just take another quick little upstream hey guys hey how are you Nadia hi there's the cast iron a very old pipe I mean it's functioning but it's extremely old and pretty much very much near the end of its life <coughs> okay I'll pull it out okay so we're probably going to recommend that this be replaced however there's no way you're going to be able to replace it, it goes under the step you're going to have to reroute it from underneath the house to the outside and that's what I would recommend Whatever you do, don't flush tampons, baby wipes, paper towels.